pet moan She blowing me like a saxophone I call that shot that can't tap my phone It's hella way, get your money long I just been like you and me, myself They think I'm crazy, it's crazy Honestly, I can kill less what they think Really, I just want the 50s and 50s Alright, so look, bro. Y'all know I be trying to put y'all on on how to make extra bread, easy bread. You feel me? Just extra income. Cause a lot of people be asking me, Trey, how you be affording this and whoop whoop. So I'm about to show y'all right now. It's this simple. So you just gonna answer these three questions, or whatever. It don't matter, right? Once you answer that, it's gonna ask you to put your email in. Email confirmed. It'll send you an email for confirmation. Well, after all of that, all you gotta do is just wait patiently for your confirmation email. And then once you get the email, it'll have a link attached in the email that'll bring you to the registration screen. So you just gotta fill out a little bit more. You feel me? A few more things that's required and questions they got for you. So they know where to send it. And eventually they gonna ask for, you know, the cash, tag, all that good stuff. And then once you do all of that, just wait a little bit more and you will get your 750. So what I'm about to do is I'm about to fill this out actually. I'm actually about to fill this out and then wait for my 750. Bro, bro, y'all see this, bro? Bro, y'all see what it say? Cash survey sent you 750, bro. Not even three minutes later after I finished the survey, bro. All y'all got to do is the steps I showed and you going to be green and you going to get your bread, bro. It, it, um, I'm going shopping. Oh, um, bro, I'm going shopping. I hope y'all follow instructions. I hope y'all get y'all cheese. And hey, let's get into the video. What it do, YouTube? It's your boy Trey and I'm back with that pressure, man. We have officially got back from Miami, got back from New Orleans. We're back home now i'm back home um i didn't record or vlog nothing on the way back because you know honestly i was really tired and i've been trying to you know get myself together kind of relax rewind a little bit because we've been on the move a lot y'all and actually right now like i feel i feel under the weather yesterday i was feeling real drained and yeah today i still feel like under the weather but that ain't gonna stop nothing i still got stuff to do i got stuff to handle uh, I got to drop bids for y'all. I got a lot of stuff to do. So I can't, I can't afford to let that knock me down. Cause you know what I'm saying? We about to fight it. We right here with it. We like, uh, we, ooh, come here. What, where you at? Ooh, come here. Ooh, boy, you better watch out. So, uh, the fuck? Today, I got a few little things to do. So I'm actually about to go to my jeweler. Um, you know what I'm saying? Get my grills clean and all that. I be trying to keep up with the maintenance on my jewelry so I can make sure everything is still right and it still look and be how it's supposed to be. So I just be, you know, keeping up with the maintenance on my jewelry and all that stuff. But I'm about to hit the jeweler. After I do that, I'm about to, um, I'm probably going to head to my mom's house. You know what I'm saying? I'm probably going to head to her crib, pop in, see my people, see my family. I haven't seen them in a minute. It's been a little minute since I've seen them or not too long, but since I've left at least. So I'll probably just pop in, see what they on, see what they doing, you know, talk to them, chat it up with them. And then after that, on my way back, I got to hit Target, y'all. Like, I got to hit Target, get a few things. I'm not about to fully go grocery shopping today, but I'm just about to get a few little things that I need because I haven't been here or been home for like around two weeks, close to two weeks. So, you know what I'm saying? I haven't been able to restock nothing, get little stuff that I need. So that's what I'm going to do. Yeah, and I'm just vlog the rest of my day. As my day go on, I'ma just vlog for y'all. And y'all can't lie, I've been dropping, bro. I've been dropping. So I'ma continue to keep dropping. It seems like y'all been loving it, y'all been liking it, and you know, y'all been tuning in. So it makes me and motivates me to keep dropping for y'all. So that's what I'm gonna do. Make sure you subscribe, roll to 200K. You know what I'm saying, you know what I'm saying, you know what I'm saying. So if you just watching me and lurking and not subscribe, you're being weird. Don't be weird, bro. You know what I'm saying? There's no reason to be weird. Feel me? It, you ain't gotta be weird, be normal. Y'all like this video up as well. It takes less than a second to like the video. Let's get this vlog rolling. Let's get this day rolling. And I hope y'all enjoy the video. Let's go. All right, y'all. So before I left, I actually had to go to the package room, you know what I'm saying? And get my package from Rockstar, you know what I'm saying? I'm a brand ambassador. So shout out to Rockstar for always sending me some fire clothes, bro. All right, y'all. So I just got here, you know what I'm saying? Just, just got here, so 
I'm about to um, go in, go up the elevator. You feel me? Get to where I need to be. And yeah, I'm gonna show y'all. I'm gonna show y'all probably a little bit. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna I'm show y'all just a little bit, little bit. But yeah, I made it here. It took me only like like 14, 15 minutes because it's towards like the south side, more so towards the south side. And um, yeah, so that's why after this, I'm gonna go to my people crib because I'm from the south side of Houston. So that's what I'm gonna do after this. But yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm up in here right now, y'all. Um, the cleaning probably gonna be about like 30 minutes. So I'm getting a quick cleaning, not a deep cleaning. So it's only gonna be like 30 minutes uh, for my cleaning. But it never take long. Like anytime I bring my grills to uh, get cleaned or whatever, I like bring anything, it never take long. But a, a deep cleaning take about a day. Now deep cleaning take about a day, but my my grills don't be just fried, so I'll be just getting quick cleaners, you know what I'm saying? All right, y'all, so, um, hold on. Put my car in. All right, y'all, so I'm out of there, you feel me? My jeweler got me right. He always get me right every single time. He never failed me. Any issues or anything I, you know, I'm dealing with, and I need to come to him for, for the get me right, he gonna get me right every time. Whether it's a new piece, whether it's fixing something on my grills, cleaning it, but he gonna get me right every time. But, um, so now, most likely, not even most likely, I am. Right now, I'm about to head to my mom crib. I'm about to head over there. Hey, though. Hey though, why my skin looking better though? Skin looking better, skin look like I'm glowing. I think it's cause I'm happy, y'all. I think that's what it is. I think it's truly cause I'm in the happiest stage I've ever been in in my life. Like real deal, like I'm just happy with life. I'm high off life, I'm not gonna lie. Like I've been living it up, I've been having fun, I've been traveling. Like I literally can't thank y'all and God enough. And I love y'all so much, bro. I want to tell y'all that I love y'all so much. And I really appreciate all y'all support because without y'all, I can't do nothing. Uh, but I'm about to head to my mom's crib. You know what I'm saying? Head back to the block. And, um, you know, just pop in. I ain't telling her and my people that I'm coming by. But this is just going to be like a pop in. I'm going to pop in. And I know she's going to be happy to see me and the rest of my family. So, um, yeah, I'm about to head there right now. All right, y'all. So I just made it. You feel me? I'm about to walk in. Hey, Stink. Hey, Ma. What you doing? Nothing. What you doing? Nothing. Just vlogging. I missed you. I missed you. Y'all, with my my dudes. You know what I'm saying? I've been gone for how long, Mama? I've been gone for a minute. Too long. Too long. You miss me? Yeah. I miss my Mama too. <laughs> what you been up to? Nothing. Nothing. Working. Working. Well, I'm back right now. I'm going to come back on the camera, y'all, in a little bit. I'm about to spend time with my people. All right, y'all. So, I spent time with my mother. You feel me? And uh, I seen my granny as well. So, um, now I'm leaving. I just left not too long ago. It's always good seeing them. You know what I'm saying? I always put a smile on my face when I see my people, see my family. So, right now, I'm about to head to Target. Back on my side, I forgot that I need to hit Target. So, that's what I'm going to do. Um... I'm gonna hit the target by my crib, go up in there, figure out what stuff I need. Back back to um seeing my people. Y'all always make me very happy to see my people. You know what I'm saying? Like every time I see them, I just put a smile on my face. They miss me. They miss me so much, y'all. If you have not experienced it yet, bro, when you um when you move out of your mom's crib, bro, like when you move out of her crib, bro, and you you know you growing up and you start doing your own thing and all that, bro, they miss, they miss us, bro. They truly miss us. And like, if you haven't experienced it yet, what you do, you will see, bro, your people, your mom, your family, or your mom and dad, whoever, they miss, they gonna miss you, bro. They really gonna miss you, your presence. You know what I'm saying? Like y'all, y'all know how your mom and your family can get on your nerves, bro. Y'all know that, y'all know that. And, and when you there, you feel me, you there every day, they nagging at you, they fussing at you, there's all this going on, you feel me? But like when you when you start to grow up and 
you get out of their crib and you start really doing your own thing and then you pop up every now and then and come back, it's like they really miss you. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, they, they really do miss you. No matter how much your people nag, like, no matter how much your people or your mom nag at you, bro, and all that, she loves you. She she really loves you. So just always keep that in mind. Like, if your mom or your people or your parents so hard on you or they, they hard on you, just know most of the times it's because they really just want the best. They really want the best for you. They really want to see you prosper. You know what I'm saying? And a lot of times they don't want to see you be like they was or make the same mistakes they did when we was they age you feel me so you know what i'm saying when you going i know it'd be annoying it was annoying me too at times like you know all the nagging all of this and that but it's like when you when you get the space to yourself and you get out on your own you realize they just doing that because they love you and they doing that because they want the best thing for you so you know you'll appreciate it more when you get older and you'll appreciate it more as you as you become a, a young adult or adult, you know what I'm saying? So I always love seeing them. But yeah, once again, I'm going to Target right now. So I'm going to um, show y'all when I get there. I'm recording and driving, which is not good. So y'all do not, do not do this at home. You know what I'm saying? Do not do this at home. I'm being a bad influence right now. Do not do this at home. Do not record and drive. Don't text and drive. Don't drink and drive. Don't do that. You feel me? Don't do none of that. And I'm actually being a bad influence right now. So I apologize to y'all. But, you know, I just wanted to talk to y'all. But I'm going to come back home once I get to Target. So, yeah. I actually just made it back to the crib. I decided not to go to Target as of now because, bro, the traffic in Houston is terrible. And it was, bro, like, Target from my crib is not far at all. It's right up the street. But it was saying it would take 34 minutes to get to Target. And who about to wait 34 minutes when I know for a fact it's up the street, like, I wasn't even gonna do that. So I just came home, went to the mail room again. Um, I forgot I had ordered something for my car. Let on, probably we going bowling right now. I don't know why I'm tired. I know back in the crib, cause y'all, since one of the days I was in New Orleans, I had went to sleep and I cut the AC on like real cold. And I feel like, or I think I went to sleep and my mouth was open. You feel me? Like. I don't know if that's ever happened to y'all, but when it's real cold in your crib or somewhere in your room and you go to sleep and maybe your mouth is open and then you wake up and your throat like scratchy or something like that, that's what it was. So after that day, my throat was kind of sore or like scratchy feeling, you know what I'm saying? And I haven't treated it at all. I haven't done nothing, taking no medicine, no cough drops or lozenges or therapy, like nothing. I haven't taken nothing. So I was just letting it be and it got worse. I woke up today and it like hurt right now. I feel great because my granny, she supplied me with some Theraflu. I drank some Theraflu. I was, um, I popped some lozenges or whatever. So that's helping me. Like right now, I feel, I feel pretty good. So later on, I'm gonna take some more. But yeah, y'all, like after that one day in New Orleans, bro, I woke up, my throat was like scratchy, bro. I'm like, man, it gotta be the AC. You feel me? It gotta be because I was perfectly fine before that. but. We're going to get past that. But, yeah, I just wanted to update y'all on that, um, that I'm back at the crib. I'm going to go to Target. Like, once the traffic die down, I'm going I'm to hit Target once the traffic die down. So, I'm still going to Target, just not as of now because the traffic is ugly. Yeah, so I just wanted to update y'all. And when I get to Target or get in Target, I'm, uh, I'm going to come back home. But, I ain't going to lie, y'all. I'm feeling kind of drowsy, kind of sleepy. And like I said, I think... It's probably because I don't know if I got took the, I don't know if I took the nighttime there for or what, but I'm kind of feeling like tired, sleepy out of nowhere. So I'm probably about to take a nap, lay down or something until the traffic die down and I'm going to come back on the camera when that time comes. So yeah. A few moments later. All right, y'all. So I'm just, just now really waking up, bro. It's like, it's probably like 10, 11 now. 9, 10, or 11, one of the two. I said one of the two. It's either 9, 10, or 11, one of the three, bro. I'm just now getting up. Like I said, um, I, I've been feeling kind of under the weather a little bit. And when I was over at my people crib, my granny gave me some medication. And it might have been a nighttime version because not too long after, once I made it home, like 
I felt real drowsy and sleepy and tired out of nowhere. And it was like I couldn't control staying up. So I went to sleep probably like around five-ish, six-ish. You know, like five or six. And I'm just now getting up. So right now in my crib is Wu, Chase, Jano, RTB. You feel me? My boy RTB be snapping up the flick. So y'all... Y'all get at him, you feel me? Especially if you're in Florida. He in Texas right now, though, so he with us. So he gonna be out here for a minute. So if y'all need somebody to take some good pictures in Houston, you know what I'm saying? RTV is the guy, facts. But I'm about to go out there and show y'all these boys, show y'all what they doing. But, whew, I feel rested. But, you know, my throat's still a little scratchy. A little bit, and ever since that hotel room, bro. Ever since I made it real cold in that hotel room that one night and woke up, my throat been scratchy since, bro. And I just haven't treated it till today, so. Hopefully it get better. I still, you know, I don't feel like terrible or nothing. It's just that, but. You know, I'm about to go out here and show y'all that. But, oh, bro, y'all. I was supposed to go to Target, y'all. But I fell asleep. I was supposed to go to Target. Um, Target might still be open. I don't know. I might just go to um, CVS because I need some little stuff, nothing too major yet or right now. Um, so I might just head to CVS because they're open 24 hours. So or the one by my crib. So I might go there. But now I'm about to go out there. I'm about to go out there and show y'all what these boys doing and all that. Twin, what's up, man? What's up, Chase? What's up, Chase? I'm shaking back, bro. Sleep all day. RTV, what's up, gang? I've been trying to say that. Ooh. Where you get the set from, bro? Why are you dripping like that? That's not drip. That's not drip? That's it hard as hell. I want I want some Capri Suns. How you gonna come over and not bring some Capri Suns, bro? We would never bring shit. Mm. I don't never bring shit. Why am I supposed to bring my food? I mean, you come over here, you get a little song, song, song. <laughs> Tell them what they did, Jano. Tell them what, they, what food they came with. They came over here with some good hibachi smelling shit. That hot shit. Stick top. Stick top. Ooh. Ooh. So what, we bowling? Yeah. 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 Future the goat, bro. But we going, we going bowling still? Yeah. I bet. Put a dip, change. Be ready, cuz. You're a geek. All right, y'all. So, look, y'all probably barely can see me. It's dark outside. But uh, we just pulled up to the bowling alley. I got on a little fit now. Y'all probably can't see. I don't know how good y'all can see. Because it's dark behind my shades. They can see? All right, bet. So, yeah. I'm wearing the fit. Right now, it's me, Jano, Chase, Ari, Wu, RTB, the man on the cam. You feel me? And we about to uh, we about to go bowling, but bro, this is ghetto, bro, because the escalator is not working. You feel me? It's not working at all. But we walking up this John. Hey, right, this is a workout, bro. I'm about to be breathing like a bull once I, you know what I'm saying? RTV on the cam, you feel me? He be getting us right, bro. He um, he was up in Austin, I think. He was over in Austin yeah. or San Antonio, one of the two. And my boy, woo, Austin. Yeah, and we went to go pick him up, and he gonna be with us, bro. And gonna be shooting our flicks for a minute, for a minute. But um, we need to hop in the studio soon too, cause I know them pictures would be crazy. But let me show y'all, everybody. That's not the right person. How was that food? How did you not know that? But you know everything else. It's actually very sad. That's what I'm saying. It's not a bad So I had to delete the whole entire post. I had to. Yeah, bro. Ari, how you been feeling since Miami? Great. Great? Yep. You been cool? City girls up. City girls up? Oh. I'm just playing. <laughs> <laughs> man, rip takeoff. Rest in peace takeoff, man. <laughs> nah, I, it just hit me. I'm like, oh, this is the... Oh, this is where you got to keep Yeah. Rest in peace to takeoff, man. Man, rest in peace to takeoff. Yeah, right here with yeah. all them roses. So why y'all let me tag Offset? <laughs> You tagged Offset? Yeah. That ain't our fault. That's <laughs> you. You need to do your research. That's oh, not us. Yo, yo. That's nah, it's not even laughing at that, but it's 
you no no you way. Feel me? Like the whole time nah, you nah, that's crazy. Oh, but yeah, I ain't never been in this bowling alley, bro. This is downtown. You know what? This downtown. But y'all, hey, rate my fit. Y'all like my fit? Rate my fit, bro. But. Two. Out of two. Out of two? Oh, yes. I did. I thought he was going to hold me for real. It's open? Yeah. Yeah, it's open. I'm going to come on the camera once we get a little more settled. Y'all, y'all see my shoes, bro? Look at the drip, bro. Uh, y'all see the drip? Yeah. <laughs> you know, <laughs> you know, you know, this is my crush, though. It's like that, Jeno. All right, what you got to say to that? Why, why are you trolling right now? He's he not trolling? the only one, Jeno. Uh. It's my dog. Yeah, yeah. That's what? <laughs> Yo, bro. That's pretty dope. Yo. I'm not playing with you. I'm sorry. Oh. Trial two. Two times a turn. Trial two. My bad. I'm not gonna lie. I'm dead. Jano turn. It's time for Jano to go. Uh oh. That's what I like to see. That's what, yeah. That's what I like to see. We gonna see. We gon' see, nigga. We gon' see, nigga. Oh. We gon' get it together. Mm. Heard that. Number four seed. Number four seed. Y'all, this nigga really suck. Hey, I'm going to try to knock them two down. I don't know how I'm going to do it, but I'm trying to Zero pins. I had to knock down one. I'm all right, though. I'm, I'm right on Ari. Yeah. Ari, you ain't going nowhere. Mm -hmm. All right, hold on. Show the score. We got to show the score. Yeah. Really? First spray. Ari, you ain't First going nowhere. I'm on your ass. First spray. I'm on your ass, man. So look, y'all, this is the updated score right here. Me and Jano on, on each other's ass. You feel me? We right here with it. We right here with it. Tough game. Ari right, just rolled. It really is. Oh. Score right there. I'm up too. I ain't gonna lie. I gotta regain myself after after him. You suck. What? You got 55. What? She 
not that far behind. I mean, she's not that far behind, but she's not catching me, though. But she's not. I mean, she might catch you, but she's not. No. No, it's not happening. Y'all, that's not happening. So, y'all, the game restarted, but, um, Jano ended up winning, bro. He won. He won by, I think, uh, five points, I think. I think he won by five. He had a real de definition of class bag. It's, it's Ari hard. Ari sucks, y'all. You never been around some motherfuckers that just don't beat you at nothing? And it'd be like, it'd be nice <laughs> to get some. You, no, no. Bro, bro, I was off at an off day. He never beats me, y'all. Last time we went, I was crossed as fuck. I was baby. I was crossed too. I was crossed too. That's the thing. I was crossed. So if. Was I crossed? No, I wasn't crossed. Okay. But I was the bro, only nigga that was fading. I, I wasn't was taking it serious, bro. I was not taking it serious. But it's good. Ari yeah. sucks. He sucks. Ari is buns. Trey, you're ass. What? You suck. What? I I cooked you. I cooked, cooked you. Wow. Run the score back. I don't know why I cooked Wait, you, yeah. What? She you have like she... what? 35 points? Oh, okay. What? 35 points? Or I right. had 77, ma'am. 77. 77, ma'am. I had 88. No, you didn't. Okay. Where, where is that? Okay. Ari had 56. Oh, that's lame, man. Ari had 56. Okay, but for the longest, I was winning. Who had 35? For the longest, don't count, though. I was, was winning, winning for, like, for the longest. Frames. No, for like five two. frames, I was winning. <laughs> nah. You she had 56. I've been, I've been up. Was being competitive. Was I, up. I was up. Was being competitive. Bro. She it's had 56. At the end of the day, she had 56 and I had 77. It's she can't Wooda, compete. Like, it's it's Wooda with 30. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. Wu had 35. <laughs> That's kind of God bad, <laughs> Now that yeah. I have one of Nah, facts. Damn. We gotta start taking that nigga bowling. This unacceptable. We gotta train him? Yeah. Hoes can't be beating him, man, but shit like that. Like, we gotta train him. I'm sorry. I know. Nah. I know. I know you're just talking. Not a hoe, but like. He gonna get slapped. He gonna get slapped, Ari? Yeah. God, dog. Uh, nice slap. But yeah, it's good though. Next time when I'm feeling better, I'm uh, I'm gonna lock in, and I'm gonna take the dub. I don't, huh? I'm not. My head is like thumping. Shit, I ain't gonna lie, y'all. Shit been looking blurry. Like literally, the pins was blurry. I'm not lying. Like I feel like I'm drunk or something. Like, why do I feel like I'm drunk, bro? All right, y'all, so we just finished bowling. You know what I'm saying? I lost by, like I said, five points, bro. So I barely lost. But, y'all, I feel like shit, bro. I feel like ass. Like, I don't feel like Trey right now. I feel like an you know, imposter or something. But we about to leave. We probably about to head back to the crib. I don't know what all we about to do. This loser just came out. Bro, he keeps saying I'm a loser, but he was losing for how many rounds? Five or six? Oh, okay. Right. He lost. He's right. I was at the end of the day. You bro, you lost, bro. You suck. Anyways. You suck at basketball. You suck at bowling. You suck at everything you do. Yeah, you Damn. Yeah, Set that up. Losing. Yeah! <laughs> okay, Set that up. Yeah, you get your that probably will be the end of my vlog, so I'm probably going to end it here. So, thank y'all for watching, bro. Road to 200K subs. We're going to get there real soon. I'm just keep dropping for y'all. Keep the content going. Y'all like this video up. But thank y'all for watching. Your boy Trey out. Gang. She blowing me like a saxophone. She blowing, she blowing me like a saxophone.